Hey, friends. I'm Derek and welcome to the channel. Here you will know everything about Dolphins. In the whirlwind of NFL offseason rumors, the latest buzz centers around the Kansas City Chiefs placing the non-exclusive franchise tag on cornerback Algerius Sneed. This move opens the door for Sneed to negotiate with other teams, potentially paving the way for a trade. Notably, two teams have emerged as potential suitors, the Detroit Lions and the Miami Dolphins. While Miami's inclusion raised eyebrows among Dolphins fans, dismissing the story outright might be premature. Let's see why this contract would make sense. First of all, leave a like on this video if you love Dolphins, help our channel reach more people. Click like now. Thanks. ESPN's Jeremy Fowler's report highlighted Miami's interest in Jarius Sneed, triggering surprise and skepticism among Dolphins enthusiasts. Questions about salary cap constraints and the feasibility of acquiring a high-profile player like Sneed naturally surfaced. However, delving into the details reveals that there might be more to the story than initially meets the eye. One key factor to contemplate is the potential loss of star defensive lineman Christian Wilkins. The Dolphins offered Wilkins a substantial contract last offseason, but if negotiations falter and Wilkins departs, Miami could gain a compensatory pick in the 2025 draft. However, engaging in free agency spending sprees might offset this compensatory pick. Enter the trade option. Acquiring Sneed could bypass the compensatory pick formula allowing Miami to secure a star player while preserving the compensatory pick. If Wilkins exits, Miami faces a void in the defensive line. Trading for Sneed not only addresses the potential loss but also brings in a seasoned cornerback to fill the void left by the departure of Xavier Howard. The need for an experienced cornerback becomes more evident, especially considering the uncertainties surrounding untested players like Cam Smith. Dolphins general manager Chris Greer has a history of making impactful moves during the offseason. Whether it's trading for star players or engaging in significant signings, Greer has a penchant for creating a buzz. Acquiring Sneed could be the splash move Greer often makes, filling a crucial position on the roster with a proven talent. The potential downside of trading for Sneed lies in parting with valuable draft picks. Recent reports suggest that the Chiefs are seeking at least a second-round pick for Sneed, presenting a challenge for the Dolphins, who have had limited early-round picks in recent drafts. Balancing the immediate impact of Sneed against the long-term consequences of losing draft capital becomes a critical decision for Miami. While losing a second-round pick might seem steep, considering Sneed's proven performance, it could surpass the value of a mid-second-round rookie. A strategic approach, such as trading back from their first-round pick to gain additional selections, could help mitigate the draft pick loss. As Dolphins fans grapple with the unexpected link to Jarius Sneed, it's essential to weigh the potential benefits against the associated costs. The intricate balance between roster needs, compensatory pick considerations, and Chris Greer's penchant for bold moves adds layers to the speculation. While a trade for Sneed may seem unlikely, the unpredictability of the NFL offseason suggests that Dolphins supporters shouldn't entirely dismiss the possibility. A surprising trade announcement could be just around the corner, reshaping Miami's defensive landscape. In your opinion, would Chris Greer trading Legereus Sneed be a good move? Does it make sense for you to bring Sneed to Miami? Leave your analysis in the comments. Remember to support the channel, leave your like and subscribe. Don't miss any update, news or insight about the Dolphins. Always stay ahead. See you soon.